Oh, hello everyone. Welcome to ECCA Week 3. Today, we'll be doing this beautiful cactus pot. I will teach you step by step on how to do this as well as mixing the colors of the plasticine too. But first, we will need our materials. The modeling tools, the four colors of plasticine, some toothpicks, a scissors and a ruler. Let's go! First, we'll be doing the pots. The colors we'll be mixing for the pots are yellow, white, red and blue. Now, cut 2 cm of yellow, another 2 cm of white, 2 cm of red and 1 cm of blue. For the blue, we will need only a quarter of the bar. Let's mix these pieces together. Ta-da! Done! We are going to do two cactus pots. So we will have to divide this brown piece into half. Do you remember how we did the pinch pot last week? It's basically using the same technique. Roll it into a ball first, then into a cylinder. I roll the bottom part of the pot a little more to achieve a tapered shaped pot. The top part of the pot should be wider than the bottom part. Next, tap both the ends to get a flat, smooth finish. The height of my pot is roughly about 3 cm. Next, we are going to do the rim part of the pot. Cut about 2 cm of red plasticine and roll it out into a coil. Use the sharp blue tool as a roller to flatten the coil. Neaten the flat coil and place it around the rim of the pot. Cut it and put it aside first. Next, we are going to do the soil for the cactus. I cut this color by mixing same amount of red, blue and yellow. Take some of it. Roll it into a ball and then flatten it like this. Before we put the piece on top of the pot, we will first cut it according to the size of the pot. Neaten the piece and place it on the top of the pot. Use the toothpick to create little holes to make it look like soil. Now, take this red piece and place it along the rim of the pot, like this. Use one toothpick, find the center part of the pot and poke it through the soil. Make sure the toothpick does not go through the pot. Next, let's move on to do the cactus plant. Cut about 1 cm of blue and 1 cm of yellow. Let's mix them to make green. Once you are done, cut off a third of it to make the arms of the cactus. Cut that little piece again into half to make two arms for the cactus. Now, roll the bigger piece into a cylinder and tap the bottom part to make a flat surface. Shape it according to your desired size. Let's make the two little arms. Shape it like a jelly bean shape. Taper the bottom part a bit before you attach it into the main plant. Blend the joints and attach the other arm. Once you are done, gently slide into the bottom part of the cactus to the toothpick. If the toothpick is too long for the cactus, you may cut the end a little bit. Next, I'm using the toothpick to create a little holes on the cactus. You do not have to poke it too deep. Do it gently. I'm going to make a cute flower for the cactus with 5 little balls of red plasticine like this. By using the long blue tool with the little rounded end, I'm going to flatten one side of the each balls. Flatten and put them side by side to form a flower. Let's move on to another pot of cactus. Repeat the same process as the previous cactus pot. For this cactus, I'm mixing a different shade of green. I'm using more yellow than the blue. You are free to mix your own shade of green. Once you are done mixing, roll it into a ball and slide it through like this. Using the long red tool, carve a line across on the center part of the ball.
carve out another line intersecting the previous line. Then, carve out a line in between each section like this. Neaten each carving with a toothpick. Remember to keep the remaining pieces in the pack according to their colors. Wipe all your tools. Wipe your table. And remember to take a photo of your works and upload them on SLS. I'm looking forward to your photo submission on SLS. Till then, have fun making the cactus pots.